Here on your website, you have a whole bunch of pages that we've given you by default. And it's really good that you have all these pages because of all the studies that we've done, these are the pages that most churches have on their websites. And they contain all the information that any visitor could ever want to know about your church when they visit your website. And so to use these pages the way that we specified would be a good idea. You don't have to, of course, but it would be a good idea. The problem with this is that it's going to take you some time to be able to write about your story, to write what you believe, to write a little biography about your pastor or your preacher. It's going to take time to, you know, upload all the events onto your calendar. It just it takes time to write these things. And in the meantime, you don't want people to see all these pages that say, to begin editing this page, hit the login link at the, in the footer. And so what you would probably want to do, if you're really eager to get people to, to get to your website and start reading and, and, and using it, you're probably going to want to turn some of these pages off temporarily until you get time to edit them. And we can do this very quickly and very easily in the back room by clicking on Pages scrolling over the page you want to get rid of I want to hide my uh, test page and hit quick edit quick edit keeps you on this page but gives you some options and one of these options is the status uh, currently the status is set to published which means that it's visible by all visitors who visit my website but I'm gonna change it to unpublished and I'm gonna update page I'm going to go back to my website, and before I hit refresh, I'm going to show you where the test page was. The test page was under Events. That's where I had my test page. It was kind of hiding from the world, but it was still on my website. Well, I'm going to go up here, and I'm going to refresh and show you what has happened. Now when I scroll over Events, Test Page has disappeared. All we have is Events Calendar. And that is a way to quickly hide any page that you're not ready to show to the world quite yet. And you don't have to delete the page. You just change it to a draft through the quick edit.